Well, um, I just woke up to the Vegas massacre, and I don't, I don't have words. I don't have words to say. It's just heartbreaking. I don't know. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Concert music festival. And Jason Aldean was on stage, closing out everything, and it took a while to realize this is not part of the show. I'm unpacking Skyla's like diaper bag from yesterday because we went. Um, to watch Nick play in his baseball game, so I packed a ton of stuff. So I'm unpacking that right now. I just saw in the news it said that this attack in Las Vegas was the um, most deadly massacre, or I forgot the wording they used, like the worst massacre in American history. I guess that means as far as like a shooting. I I don't know. It's, Especially when you have kids, it's so like, it's so hard because she's, you know, they're so innocent and they have no idea what's going on and the fact that one day you have to tell them about all this and that they have to learn the way of the world is just really heartbreaking. My thoughts and prayers are with everyone who has had a family member affected in the shooting. I just can't imagine what you're going through. <laughs> Skyla's in a super, um, she likes, she wants to be held all the time, I've told you guys that, but yeah, yeah, yeah. you do. Yeah. I had to hold her yeah. while I was brushing yeah. my teeth, no joke, yeah. I held her while I was yeah. brushing my teeth. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, are you biting me now? Anyway, we normally go work out, or I go work out, before, um, before her first nap time, but it's almost 10 and her first nap is usually between 10 and 11. So we're gonna have to go after nap time because today we were just kind of running behind, just been running, running, running behind. You know what happens someday. So after first nap, I'll go work out. But I'm about to put my new tennis shoes on. I, if you guys follow me on social media, you've already seen them. But uh, a lot of you guys know that I love tennis shoes by Pink Ivy. And I got a new pink pair sent to me from Pink Ivy. And they have AB crystals and they are so, so cute. I'm about to try them on for the first time and show them to you guys. I'm really excited about it. Are you? We need to get you some crystal shoes. Oh. Here they are. Aren't those so pretty? Skyla, we're gonna put on mommy's crystal shoes. Do you wanna see? Do you wanna see them? Aren't they shiny? They're cute, honey. Oh. Okay, I know. Skyla's got my wallet, so crisis averted for just a minute. <laughs> Here they are. They look awesome. The owner of the shop gave me a code for you guys to use if you want to get, I think it's $15 off. It's either $15 off or 15% off, I can't remember. I think it's $15 off at her shop, um, which is Pink Ivy on Etsy. And my code is just Aaron. It's just my name, Aaron. And I'll put it down in the description bar with all the other links in case you forget. It is just about that time for nap time. Skyla's been running around the house screaming. And Nick is working from home today. So we are sitting on the couch reading 10 in the bed. 10 in the bed. They all rolled over and one fell out. Oh, oh, oh. What'd the little one say? <laughs> yeah, that's what the little one said. That's what my little one said. Oh. Roll over, it's the last page. You're missing out. Bell? 
You okay? What happened? Where's Duchess? Did she bite you? I'm lonely. Yeah. So they all climbed in and snuggled up tight. Good night. Good night. Okay, does that mean it's time for bed? Time for nap? We actually turned our fire on today for the first time because it was really cold when we woke up and Skyla, oh, you can't have that. Skyla was freezing this morning when I went and um, got her out of bed. No, Skyla, uh-uh. She's trying to take everything out of that tray. Skyla just got up from her nap. I fed her some tortellini with fettuccine and some strawberries. And I've been working a little bit more on my vlog. And I was just about to go work out and Nick called me and was like, hey, the um, HVAC guy is coming and you have to be there for that. So, change of plans. And now Skyla's bringing me a book. This is the one we just read. Okay, hold on. I think what we'll do is start getting out some of the Halloween decorations and Skyla will probably think that's fun because there's no way that she remembers any Halloween decorations from last year so maybe this year she will have a little bit of fun looking at the decorations. What do we have? Lots of Halloween stuff. <laughs> He's going to the kitchen. Careful. Don't break anything, okay? Sparkles. That looks good. It's up here. Don't steal it, though. Okay, this guy will go outside once Nick gets the thing to hang it because it has like a, it has to be hung from the ceiling outside on the patio. And then this is my favorite Halloween wreath ever. It's from Etsy. Um, and I need to get wreath hangers because I don't, my door's really tall so I don't know if I can do like over the door. I don't, my over the door hanger won't work. And then we have a strobe light and we have a fog machine downstairs and we also have a gargoyle downstairs that Nick will um, have to go get. And then you guys remember this runner from last year from Pier 1, put that up. And back here, I did, I changed out um, the pine cones for pumpkins and put those black candles in there that I had last time. Of course I put my, um, spider web up with the spiders and another um, pumpkin one with the black candles in there. Pretty good. I've got to put away these pine cones from that were in those jars to begin with and then that's like my winter stuff that needs to go downstairs. I put these glittery pumpkins and gourds from Hobby Lobby in there. I have this little skull that my friend brought me back from Mexico. I made this trick-or-treat sign back when I was making my Yetis. Um, I just got the trick-or-treat sign at Michael's and I did spray adhesive and then I would, I sprinkled the glitter down and then sprayed, yes baby, and sprayed a sealer over the top. And then I put a pumpkin up there as well as you probably can't see it very well um, because it's not very light in here, but I have like three little spider things that can go inside a plant or you can put them on their own in a vase. They have spiders and like they're gold and black like swirls. Um, it's hard to really see, but in person you can, um, you can see it. Then I have my pumpkins here from Hobby Lobby and of course, of course we have a pumpkin dish towel. I put a little gem spider around the dish soap dispenser. I put a little spider web up on this mirror just a little bit with the spiders because it's super creepy for Halloween. And then I did the same in here on this mirror. 
little spiders. One of them has like a little jewel on him. And then I showed you guys this. And then I put like another one of those little spiders just right here. Oh, I have a pumpkin plug-in from Hobby Lobby. I have one little glitter pumpkin here. I think this is from Hobby Lobby or Target. It's just a really pretty sparkly glitter pumpkin. And then I have this like face mask that I thought was pretty cool. I think I got it at either Hobby Lobby or Target. So I just kind of put those in the built-ins because I don't have a lot of Halloween stuff for the built-ins. So that's like kind of the, some of the only stuff I have. People might think that like that's just like a decor item, but it's actually for Halloween. Um, and then I put this up. This is from Pure One we got last year um, to go above the mantle. Just like glittery black and orange patterns and I like that and then this is my other pumpkin gold and glitter of course either um, Hobby Lobby or Target is where I got that one and I put this just in Skyla's bathroom right there and then this pumpkin that I made I just put those in here because they have the purple and I thought they'd be cute in her bathroom the HVAC guy just left he figured out what was wrong with our AC unit and fixed it so glad that that happened and we need to go head to the gym um, pretty soon so we can get that over with. The later in the day that it gets, I like the less motivation I have to get my workout done. So we need to go do that ASAP. All right, I found this little pumpkin downstairs. This is like one of the last things that my dad and I bought together. We were in Santa Fe and I found this and bought it so that's one of my last memories of my dad so I put it in our little coffee station I found one of Skyla's Halloween books she has a ton but this one was downstairs so I got that and you guys probably remember these <laughs> our Halloween PJs and this pumpkin I think is from Hobby Lobby I just put that in this little tray here in the built-in um, I didn't know where to put it I couldn't think of anywhere else for it so I just moved there was like a little green ball that was sitting there so I just moved it to that basket but the greenery is more like springtime stuff so I probably need to move the greenery for fall because it kind of clashes with the pumpkins so I don't know where I'm gonna put it but I probably need to move the green stuff okay so we were gonna go work out mm. it has to be my teeth I was just eating a protein box from Starbucks we were gonna go work out and I didn't realize that they didn't have the, um, like there's like special times that are only available for the kids, the kids care. So, I wasn't able to work out. Um, I'm gonna go back though, cause they reopen. But normally I go in the morning, so that's never like an issue. So, um, we're gonna go into Lowe's because I need to get pedestals for the washer and dryer because I should have done that to begin with and I didn't. So we're gonna get pedestals and a couple other things like potting soil and like door hangers or a wreath hanger for the front door. Skyla's having a piece of cheese from my protein box and it's ended up on her shirt. She's wearing her new bracelet that were sent to my P.O. box. They're so cute, but she ripped the tassel off and like started eating it. So, the tassel went bye-bye. Uh, we're gonna get Stay Green. Make mommy do some work, huh? <sighs> okay, a lot has happened since I was last on here. Um, after we went to Lowe's, we went to um, Off-Broadway Shoes to get Converse and they were having, because I needed a pair of Converse. I've never had them before. And um, I mean, yesterday when we were going to the game, I was like, oh, what kind of shoes can I wear that are just super casual, but really cute. And I ended up wearing my Nikes and in my head I was like, oh, I would love to have a pair of Converse. This would be a perfect outfit for Converse. So I went and got them and it was buy one get one half off so I got Skyla a pair too for 15 bucks so we went and did that and then um, we went to the gym and I'm telling you I thought that my workout today was going to be a complete joke because I was so tired today I've just been feeling super run down and super pregnant 
and just not good. I, I have not been feeling good today in all honesty. And so I was like, I, I was honestly trying to like talk myself out of going the whole drive there. I was like trying to make excuses to not go. And I did it and I actually killed my workout. New releases. First girls trips, first one that came up when you said it like that. <laughs> we decided to watch Notorious B.I.G. Okay, I'm going to bed. Nick's already been in bed for like 30 minutes and I've been sitting in the living room on my phone. So thanks for watching this vlog. I will see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and check out the links below my video and I will see you guys in the next one. Good night.